Okay, so I want to sort of bring this up again uh, because somebody last night uh, mentioned this to me about this idea of a seven-year tribulation. All right, and I want to make this simple and as clear and easy to understand as possible. The seven-year tribulation is based on Daniel chapter 9. It's not based on anything in the New Testament because it's not there. And it's not even in Daniel 9. And I'm going to show you. It's going to be simple. Here in Daniel 9, you'll see right here, if you type in seven-year tribulation Bible verse, and the first one that comes up is Daniel 9, verse 27. And it says, And he shall confirm the covenant with, with many for one week. And you see here, this website is saying it's the Antichrist. All right, but who does the Bible say? And after three score and two weeks shall Messiah be cut off. Now, if your Messiah is the Antichrist, you're in trouble, buddy. I'm telling you right now. You're in a whole lot of trouble. The Antichrist is not the Messiah. Jesus Christ is the Messiah. But these liars are turning Jesus Christ into the Antichrist. And it, verse 27, And he shall confirm the covenant with many for one week. This is talking about Jesus Christ, not the Antichrist. And this was already accomplished. All right, and the, the covenant is with us that believe in the Lord Jesus Christ. It's that simple. All right, there is no seven year tribulation. And if, 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 you know, if you want, I guess I can go to Matthew 24. There is no seven year tribulation. It talks about the great tribulation up that leads up until the end of the world. That just simply means things are going to get tougher and tougher. I mean, that's what everything here is about. There's, there will be deceivers. There will be troubles. All the way up until the end of the world. The end of the world is verses 29 through 31. And that's consistent all throughout the Bible. Okay, and then... Of course, uh, you should expect to have tribulation. In the world, you shall have tribulation, but be of good cheer. I have overcome the world. All right. So to summarize, there is no seven-year tribulation coming after the end of the world. I'm telling you, the end of the world is... The end of the world. 